Not a major wrestling event is taking mm -hmm. place this weekend despite the coronavirus pandemic, but it's happening without fans. Yeah, for one young South Florida fan, though, who is battling a health issue that meant his dream of watching WrestleMania in person isn't going to happen. But as sports director Will Manso shows us, his favorite wrestler made another dream come true. And we have a little surprise for you. Somebody wants to talk to you. Okay. That surprise for 15-year-old Anthony Primavera was a message from his favorite athlete. Ready? Anthony, what's up, buddy? Roman Reigns here. Anthony is a kidney disease patient who goes to weekly dialysis sessions at Joe DiMaggio Children's Hospital. He's also a huge fan of WWE superstar Roman Reigns and was scheduled to see Reigns at WrestleMania in Tampa this weekend before the coronavirus pandemic forced the show to go on without fans. We actually have a mutual friend that told me about you, told me that you were a, a big fan of mine a huge supporter of mine and um, told me you're going through a rough time right now and I just want you to know that I'm thinking about you. Uh, you know what I mean? Anthony I still got to see a show of support from Reigns, who has battled cancer twice in his life and decided this week that he would miss WrestleMania due to concerns surrounding COVID-19. But he still got a big win with his message to Anthony. I know we're under some strange times right now, but hopefully we can get back to normal. Uh, and if we get back to a situation where I can come visit or possibly stop by, uh, I would love to do that. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. So we add heartwarming to see Anthony's big smile. Now, the way this all came together is that members of the hospital's foundation, the child life team and medical team all got together, put in a call to Roman's people, got in touch with Roman. He said, I'd be happy to do it. He sent that video and you saw all that great reaction from Anthony, who right now is probably feeling like a WWE champ. That'll do it for the news at 5.30. The news at 6 starts right now.